Oh. Oh. Miserable morons, piss off. This is my zone. You ain't got the right to be here. Get out of my sight, you phantom of shit. Or phantoms of shit, rather. It's plural. Gotta get it right. You. It's you. You're the source of all my troubles. The ectoplasmic lord who's been eyeing my beloved zone. What do you want? Why have you decided to be a pain in the ass? I've dedicated my whole life to this place. You've got no right to ruin it with your damn ghosts. Shove off. You're mistaken. I'm not a phantom. I'm a purifier. I've come to purge the world of these ectoplasmic beings. How dare you respond. And how dare you imagine that I just put up with this shit. Listen good, I'll make this simple. Get out of here and take your goddamn specters with you or I'm gonna kill you. I hope that's clear enough for you. If I see you again, you're dead. The tramway can now stop in Alma. Okay, I guess we're going to Alma. You can only return to this room through floor 10, 2, 5, 8. Okay. Let me just circle 10, 2, 5, 8 just in case. Whoops. Alma, here we come. Uh, I don't have the right to let anyone pass. Unless, unless they answer some questions. Uh, okay. The second came from... D Jerusalem and what? What are you talking about? Orda? Okay. The Holy Trinity. La Santa Trin okay. It's just a different way of saying the Holy Trinity is made up of Whoa. <laughs> Wins? Notre Dame first appeared on the... Fourth? How many threes are there in June? What? What? Huh? I d so, what? I don't even know what that means. 19? Cyril, Kevin, and... Jonas? Or, I... One or more of your answers were false. Okay? I don't know how to get the answers to any of those questions. Not a single one. I guess I'm not allowed in Alma. So... Do I need to purify the mines? Which I seem incapable of doing. Oh, whoops. No, that's also not where I meant to go. I mean, I don't think purifying that, uh, the postal office or whatever really was what I needed to do because that's not the mines. Nope. Still need to find the chief of the specters. The chief of the specters? Where are the chief of the specters? Where is the chief of the specters? Uh. 
Any help? Hmm. Okay, well, I guess I'm back to it. Um, I'm gonna cut here, and when I come back, I guess I will have found something. Alright, so I went around the mines some more for like 10 minutes, and kind of mind-numbingly kept fighting enemies, which has grinded me up to level 7, and my add-on is level 6, and I have 3,695 credits. Yeah. It wasn't too much fun. I still had no idea what the hell to do in there. I didn't find anything of any use. The only thing I can find in the freaking mines is just that switch, which was on by default and seemed to do nothing. And then I turned it off, originally, and it seemed to do nothing. So I turned it back on, and it seemed to do nothing. I have no idea. I don't get it. But uh, I went looking around for some hints on the main thread where you find the game. Uh, the link to that will be in the description. And I was looking for some hints as to what to do in the mines, and I didn't find it, but I did find another hint. They suggested, when trying to get past this person into Alma, when you have to answer the questions, someone said, hint, look at the posters on the right. And I thought, what? What posters? Uh, apparently these little dots here are posters. Not that you could possibly know that, because they look like little... Honestly, I, I just assumed that they were windows. Very strange little pokey hole windows. That's what they look like. I mean, they look just like windows, but apparently the posters. Uh, take a closer look. Sure. What the f... Up and down, observe. Left, right, previous, next image. Enter, quit. Oh. Oh, God. Well, this is going to be a mess, isn't it? Mars. I'm not even going to try to pronounce that. That looks like it's in French. 18th of Damanche. Um. Okay. I can see that there's definitely information to solve the puzzle in here. I see Jerusalem. And surreal, but what were, what were the questions even? Maybe I should get the questions from... Let's get the questions from him. Okay. The second came from De Jerusalem and Oh god. This is not going to be interesting to play through, is it? Is it? I don't mm. It's going to be a lot of writing. I'm not sure whether to cut this out or not. I'm not going to cut it out. I guess we'll see how this goes. You can you can skip it if this puzzle solving isn't too interesting, but this is kind of borderline where I'm not sure whether to cut it or not. Let's see. So, second from Jerusalem. Third from... Question mark. Okay. The Holy Trinity. I see they have a translation there. La Santa Trinita or whatever. Which I'm assuming is what's actually going to show up in the image. Since I, I'm assuming the image has not been translated into English. So that was number one. Number two... Holy Trinity. Listen, ah, that's fine. Made of question mark. Uh, yeah, whatever. Oh, oh fuck, I skipped it. Well, we'll have to come back to that one. N number four. How many threes are there in June? How? That's such a weird question. How many threes are in? Jewin. Jewin. Okay. Seventeen. Surreal. Kevin. And. Question mark. I 
If you could see the horrible quality of my writing, you would be scared. I'm not even sure if I can read it. Okay, what was number, what was number three? All right. Notre Dame first appeared on question mark. Right. Let's find the answers. Hmm, let's see. Second came from Jerusalem, the third came from what? Um Wait the second the second the second what? Well, there's Jewin. Well, what was about Jewin? How many threes are in Jewin? Oh. Oh. That's a lot of threes. Uh, one, I guess just count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, oh god. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one. I believe. One, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one. 22! There's one hiding down below. You all- I almost missed you! You thought you could hide from me. Nope. You can't. How many are there? There's three. Okay. Cyril, Kevin, and... I see- I see Kevin. Cyril? Kevin, and Jonas, I, I guess. Alright, that's two out of the five. The Holy Trinity is made up of... Let's look for the Holy Trinity. Where's the Holy Trinity? Why can't I go up? Up. Go, there you go. Wait a minute, hold on. Here's something about Notre Dame. Notre Dame. Uh, first appeared on the... Um... I... I'm not sure which part of this is the... The date? Is it the 6 E.M. me? What the f... What, I don't even know what that means. Maybe. Anyway, Holy Trinity. Where is it? Can I, can I move? Can, can, there you go. Okay. It seems to take like 10 seconds for you to be able to move up and down. Hmm. Oh, there's the Holy Trinity. The Holy Trinity is made up of... Of what? I... Dimanche? Is that, is that a made-up-of thing? It's made up of... What, what is that? I don't even know what that means. Something tells me the fact that this game was originally in French and that all of this text appears to be in French because it's an image, so you can't really just translate that. Something tells me that that is making this puzzle extraordinarily awkward. Okay. The second came from Jerusalem, the third from... Well, this one says Jerusalem. Is it the year? 386? 386. Hmm. There doesn't seem to be the second. That seems to be the first, just going by the dates. Wait a minute, wait, there's another Jerusalem here. 
and 251. I'm so confused, like, I don't know what, what are these things are people's names, or place names, or what? Like, I don't, I can't process this information. Like, S. Cyril de Jerusalem 386, is Cyril a person's name? Is de Jerusalem a place? D. Jerusalem and 386, is that a year? Is that BCE? Is that BCE? Or not? I, I, I don't know. If it is BCE, then a smaller number would actually be newer. Because that's how that works. This is making my brain hurt. I, I don't know. I'm going to just try to answer the questions. We'll see if this works. Okay, the second came from... I think I'm about to s s <coughs> sneeze, was what I was going to say. The second came from Jerusalem and... VN? The Holy Trinity is made up of... What do I have here for that? Demet... Di no, it. What the fuck? I don't know. Notre Dame first appeared on the... Okay, this one I have. The sixth. That is apparently what 6CME means. 6CME! The sixth. How many threes are there in June? It should be 22. Yep. Surreal, Kevin, and Jonas. Okay. So... Good. Good. And good. So, Alright, so I have three of them down, but I need to know the Holy Trinity, and the second came from Jerusalem, the third from... something. Yeah. <laughs> so, back to this. Okay. Holy Trinity is made up of... There's the Holy Trinity. The Saintful Trinity. La Santa Trinita, or something? Well, I see roses up there. Is that what it's made up of? I guess. Like at the bottom, Ses Campagnans Uganda? 1886? What is that? I don't even know what that means. I know Uganda is a place and 1886 is a year, but what is Sescampagnans? Is that a place? Is that a person? Is that a... Does that mean campaign? Campagnans? I don't know what this means. This... I, I think this is like almost totally lost in translation. But, okay, roses. A diamanche apparently has nothing to do with this. I don't even know what that means, diamanche. Is anyone actually still watching me? Has anyone actually not skipped watching me solve these? Because this is kind of painful. But I am actually doing something. I'm not just beating my head against a wall. Which is why I haven't cut it. Because when I'm just like wandering around and I have no idea what the hell I'm doing, that's when I cut. But this... No. It's kind of painful, but... I am actually making progress. Okay, the second came from De Jerusalem. And the third from something. Well, that's Kevin from 618. Um, okay. Oh, look. There we go. Has anyone had a seizure yet? Puzzles are best solved like this. Just don't even focus on the image, just kind of like, just kind of let the image pass over you and just permeate into your brain. Yes. The second came from Jerusalem. The 
third from... Well, if I'm just assuming this is just the second post... I mean, se the second what? The second... Is it based on the date? Because this is the 18th. That's the 11th, and the other one's the 3rd. Th so that would not make that the 2nd, that would make that the 3rd. So that doesn't even make any sense. And th there's two Jerusalems here. The first came from Jerusalem. There's Cyril and Alexander. Does, does D mean of? Cyril of Jerusalem, or what? I... <laughs> Below it, it says Sereno, Cero, Cyril, Seriel. What is that? Variations of the person's name? I don't know. I don't know. Well, they're all from the same year. Apparently, they're all from 2007. Fevrier. Fevrier, what? I don't know. I'm just gonna brute force that one. There's only three options. Lourdes. Let's go with Lourdes. I'm gonna write that down so I know I don't do it again accidentally. That's assuming the others are correct. Roses. The sixth. 22. Jonas. Let's try that again. Orda. Roses. The sixth. 22. Jonas. All your answers are correct. Why, thank you. Well, I actually managed to solve that. But, uh, there is one more question. Uh oh. If you turn the month March, Mars, upside down, what two digit number can you read? Um. Um. Wasn't it 19? So if you turn 19 upside down, then don't you get 61? Nope! <laughs> 1918. Eh. It was close. Wait a minute. There's... Wait a minute. There's a number inside of the number. Okay, so... I guess it's... 78? I guess it's 78. Oh good, I can skip the rest of them. Wait, what? That's... That's not? Uh... I'm just gonna turn my head upside down, sort of. Okay. I mean, it looks like 87 to me. Or it could just be 81, I guess. But no, that looks like a 7. That definitely looks like a 7. Wait, I put in 78. Maybe it should be 8. Ah. <sighs> I don't even remember which one I put in now. Did I put in 78 or 87? Let's try both. I think I did 78. Let's do 87. Okay. Solved. Correct. Uh, what? Okay, apparently I need to fight them now.
My... My nails are all dirty. That's the last thing he said before he died? Okay. So yeah, this puzzle here, I think it would have made sense. I think it probably would have been satisfying and interesting if... You actually knew French, but... Since I don't, and obviously translating an image is not exactly the same as translating text, because text you can pretty easily change normally. To translate it into a different image, but to actually change... Uh, to translate it into a different image. To translate it into a different language. But to translate an image, that's a little bit more difficult. Especially one like this. Where it's kind of handwritten rather than just... I mean, yeah. It just looks kind of hand done. So without entirely recreating the thing, you really couldn't translate it into English. But there's an obvious problem with this whole thing being in French, and that's that it's extremely awkward to figure out what the hell is even going on in this. I still don't even know what I'm looking at. Like, the format of it just doesn't trigger in my mind. I don't know what these things mean. I don't know what was places and what was names and what. And what does a little cross followed by, I'm assuming, a year mean? BCE? Or, or what? I don't know. I don't know what that means. You can see that they try to... to kind of help you along by putting little hints as to what the... F what the... F I'm assuming that is French, right? What the French version of the text was, like Mars, March is Mars. They put that into the text, and it helped a bit, but... Yeah, that puzzle just doesn't work in that form, unfortunately, thanks to the translation. Oh well, I mean, what are you gonna do? I'm sure they did the best they could. You, you, uh... I'm here to see Dedan. D Dedan. Yes. Yes, of course. Huh. You're here at the meat... F <laughs> what? You're here at the meat fountains of Alma, the center of the first zone. The Meat Fountains? Um, what? Here, meat flows freely, continually f filling these immense metal pools you see before you. Our work consists of pouring this meat into bottles before the fountains overflow. The meat is then immediately delivered to all the other zones, from Zone 1 on. As the first of four elements, it's an important element. Well, there's the fourth element, meat. So what do we have? We have smoke, metal, plastic, and meat, which are apparently all first of four elements. Which doesn't make any sense, that's impossible. They can't all be first. Anyway, what does the first element even mean? The first to be discovered? Because without meat, people would have nothing to eat. They would die of starvation, one after another. M Master Dedan has an office in the center of the fountains. But, but nobody has ever found it. Generally speaking, Master Dedan seems to only appear when necessary. Well, uh, there. Who are you? Anyways. I've come to liberate the world of malignants. Oh. Oh, really? Uh, well then. Can you liberate me? <laughs> okay, they want me to kill them. If you want me to, okay, I'll do it. My gift to you. Perhaps it will get better now. They really want to be killed, don't they? They're happier to be dead than live their current life. What's so bad about their current life? 
I mean, as far as I can tell, they all just live in factories and they have hollow-eyed looks and it looks like their faces have melted. They obviously don't look happy, but... Why exactly? You again. <laughs> Hello, Sam. In good shape? Perhaps you have some spare credits. <laughs> yes, I do. I have about a million spare credits. Color of Wrath. Sure. It's not like I'm going to run out of money. Anything else? Nope. Check that out. What is that? Oh. Apparently it's a defensive item. Gives me two defense. Yep. I will take it. And in fact, I will buy another one for my add-on. <laughs> I'm assuming I can wear it. Mm-hmm. Why is there a symbol of a human being on the wall? Please let me work. Uh, I apparently I have to kill them? Is that what they meant by work? They want to work to try to bring about my death? I don't know. Yet, I've never been ill. What? Petalo recovery point. Call a petalo? Uh, what? What the hell's a petalo? No, I don't. I don't want a petalo. I don't even know what it is. What the hell's a petalo? A bike? I mean, it has a pedal in the name. Maybe it's a bike. Uh, are you alive? I guess I'm gonna get a pedalo. Oh! I see. <laughs> Wee! This is awesome! I'm now swimming. Well, not swimming. But I'm moving through meat. Liquid meat. That is disgusting. You can even hear the slimy, slithery meat noises. Oh, what is that? Hold on, that's gotta be worth writing down. A white one and a black four. There's another one up here, isn't there? Yep. Okay. Three and an eight. Four and a two. Four and a two. Oh my god, I'm gonna write down my four and my two, and what the fuck are those things? They're coming out of the meat. Uh, let's examine them. That was not the examination. That is not what I meant to do. Crap. Quantary? Aquatic ghoul with a radiant smile. <laughs> radiant smile, that's one way to put it. Light weakness against plastic. Well, I have no plastic attack, so that doesn't matter. Alpha level 7 achieved. Converted chain has been acquired. Ooh, new competency. Special attack of mediocre impact. 
Okay, so I guess what low impact and mediocre impact means is basically just the damage. So it costs more, but it does more damage. I'm assuming it's pro uh, proportional to the cost. So double... Uh, this costs double the competency point, so it probably does double the damage. That's my assumption. Well, there's another petalo point. I don't want to be burnt. I promise I won't burn you. Alright, let's try this um, converted chain. Oh, 161 hit points of damage. Nice. That is powerful. <laughs> I have so many luck tickets. Well, crap. Famous last words. Alright, how many luck tickets do I have? I have 26 luck tickets. Maybe I should use them. Nah. I'm gonna have like 2,000 by the end of the game. Who needs a luck tickets? I'm naturally lucky. Wait a minute. So what happens if I get a petalo there? I don't seem to need it. I don't want to be a phantom. With any luck you won't be, I'll blast you into smithereens so you'll never be able to become anything again. What's happening to me? Um, I think that's the feeling of dying. Hold on. I want to try these petalos over here, starting with the left. Oh, wait. Oh, I thought it'd give it to me here. Oh wait, wait a minute, is that a place to... Like, do these things? Hit them? Press them? Do the password thing? I can't seem to use them. We're no longer productive enough. If I'm not working, who is going to? They seem to be obsessed with work. Dead end. There we go. Oh, that'll take me back down on the other s- Oh, wait. Ooh. Hmm. What? Oh. Oh, there's three of them. Okay, let's break out the competencies. More numbers, but before I was reading them from the bottom up, and now I'm reading them from the top down. Hopefully it doesn't matter. Five, six. Huh?
Alright, just two batches of numbers. I wonder what they're used for. A silver flesh has been found. Oh, great! I can add that to my growing collection of now ten. Along with all of my, uh... All of my meat in my orbs. Belial's meat. Abaddon's meat. Taurus orb, or Taurus orb. Libra, Gemini, Scorpio, Capricorn, Virgo. More numbers. Seven, nine, and eight, and C again, which I'm pretty sure means ten. Okay. So it seems like what I was achieving here was getting all of these passwords, but what are they passwords to? Passwords to what? There's got to be somewhere to enter them. Where? See, the fact that I haven't done the mines yet makes me think that I'm maybe going ahead too far in this point. Maybe this is something that I need to use somewhere that I haven't unlocked yet because I haven't finished the mines. Or maybe I need to do this before I can do the mines. I don't even know. Like, this seems like where I should enter it. After all, there are ten here. But I can't seem to use them. Let me try them all. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, you can. Okay, starting with four. Hold on. Okay, four is the black number that I encountered first. See, there's a white one on the left and a black one on the right for each combination of numbers. So it was four. So what's it gonna do? Is it going to ignore the white ones for now? Let's assume it is. If we're just going with the black ones, then the next one would be 9. Okay. And then... 8. Alright, so we're ignoring the white ones. And 2. 5. Wait, what? Why did that not work? Strange. Four, nine, eight, two, and then the next white one is five. Unless it's nine? No. Hold on. Let me make sure I wrote these down correctly. Okay, so two is the last one that worked. And that's the last one on this pathway. So when I go to the five, which is the first one you encounter over here, that's when it's not working. There's the five, six, five, because I'm going with the black only. So I'm thinking, because I read the other ones from the bottom up, maybe I need to go from the bottom up here. Oh, hello.
The batter level 8 achieved. Save second base has been acquired. Where is it? Oh, there it is. Restores a lot of HP, okay. First base, so moderate amount. Second base, more. So starting from the bottom up, you'd have... Well, 6-5, right? Yeah, 6-5. Six, 5-6. Five. Five, six. Oh, God. More. Let me put dividers here so I know which one is which line. So it's 5-6, right? Yep, 5-6. So there's only two on this run. And this is from top. Ah, no, I'm not going to write that. And then I discovered two more numbers which were down here, correct? Yeah. 7, 9, and 8, C. So... Which pathway do I follow down these numbers? Or up these numbers? I hate you things, you damn things that, whose names I forgot. Just die already, please. I'm basically out of competency points. Okay. So once again, we're going with the black for some reason. I don't know. I'm not sure why we're ignoring the white. But we are. Eight. Two. Okay, that's the end of the first line that I went up. If I start... Let's, let's go with the white ones now. Let's go with one. No. Fuck. Okay. Time to do it again. Right, so we're not... Okay, let's try six. Four, five, six. Okay. Six and then five. Okay. And then... Um... Hold on, let me write this down first. And then ten and then nine? Nope! Two, six, five. So I, I'm going only with the blacks, and I'm going with the the black numbers in the order that I went up it on the first line, and then I'm going with the black numbers in the order opposite that I went down it. Does that make any sense? Four, nine, eight, two, and the next order that I went down was five, six, but I'm doing it in reverse, six, five, which is what I just did. So now what? Do I go to the white one? Hmm. Maybe it's 9 and then 10. Okay. I'm gonna get this. I am I realize that my reasoning probably doesn't make any sense. It's hard to explain exactly what I'm thinking and what I have written down right now. Six five, And then 9, 10. Okay. Wait, is that... Is that it? Can I... Yeah, okay, that's it. They're good. I'm assuming that opens the front door. Hmm. 
But what are the white numbers for? Because I only did the black ones. So what does that mean? There's no way the white ones are just po are just there for fun. They're not useless. They can't be. Let's go get our competency points back. How many safe slots do you have? 15. But yeah, front door is open. <laughs> With the, uh, the contrast of the meat against the ground, it actually kind of looked like lava at first. Because it's so red. Oh god, is this a maze? What the? I. Oh god. I went to the, like, one side and then went back to the other side and now I'm in a different place. Hi. I wish you a good day, omnipresent comrade. You will soon be able to admire all the apples and ultramarine landscapes of this area. You seem bewildered by the unique architecture of this place. If that is the case, you should learn to concentrate. In order to not be misled whilst choosing the opportunities offered at each corner of the maze, you had better remain and ponder a little while longer before crossing one of these trap doors next time, young drunkard. Ponder. Okay, thanks. Oh, what the hell? I see. Left. Right. <laughs> uh, left. Left? Nope. L left. Up? Yes, left up. You're not supposed to do this by brute force, are you? Hold on, I'm running out of room to scribble notes. Left up. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, the music gets louder when you get towards the place you're supposed to go, doesn't it? It does, yeah, okay. <laughs> I guess I'm following the trail of music? Oh, ah, crap, I didn't mean to go. Oh, yeah. Man, the triggers for these doors are really kind of far away. This game is made in, um, I believe it's the RPG Maker engine, and as a result of that, I believe it has a tile. It has a tile-based movement system, so you can't move in small amounts. Just in case you're wondering why it's this is so difficult, not to get close to the door, and that's because if you press if you press the arrow key just once, look at how much you move. Yeah, so I'm getting close to the door. I'm like, ooh, I'm gonna just sit back, but nope, he just keeps going, because it's a tile-based system. So, yeah, that's why. Gotta be really careful. Bing bingo? I think I, I get what the hell are these things? Um What are you? Erpagon, four legged ghoul with a liable breath. What what does liable breath even mean? Light weakness against metal.
uh, I guess I made it? I think so. Somewhere, a Joker has been found. Oh, I think that allows you to revive your comrade, right? Revives the person. Oh, this allows you to return to the nothingness. It's one of those boxes. Where is this taking me? You know what? As much as I'd like to know where this is taking me, I'm going to save that for the next episode. It's going to be a cliffhanger. Ooh. The real reason I'm ending the episode is because I just realized it's 11 p.m., so I should probably stop before it becomes midnight, and then I end up going to bed at like 1 a.m. This game is big. It's really big. This is only one zone. I mean, what did, what did I do? I think I started out in zone 0, right? And this is zone 1. And there's at least a couple more zones. This is, this is a really big game. I'm surprised. Yeah, and I'm still very much enjoying it. The puzzles, aside from... I mean, the puzzles are actually... Genuinely well designed. I mean, the one with the whole translation issues, that's not, that's not a design issue, that's just... You know, a problem with languages. I mean, it happens. You'd have to recreate the entire image for those to really work right. So that's not a problem in puzzle design. They're, they're just... The puzzles are actually good. They're satisfying to solve. I'm impressed. Really, the only major problem I have with the game is just the combat. Is... At least... At least during the mines, is just... Really tedious. It kind of mind-dumbingly, you take like two steps and then you encounter more enemies that are just incredibly easy to kill, but take a while because you have to just keep mashing space and waiting for the game to respond. That's the only real problem I have with the game, is just too many enemies that aren't particularly interesting to fight. And that's it. I'm still really impressed with it. It's strange, and... It's strange, but it's a well-realized world. It's not just... You know, it's not like completely random strange. It feels like there's a structure to it. Like there is something behind it. There's some sort of method to the madness. There's some sort of reason why I'm swimming in meat. And why there's four elements that are metal, plastic, smoke, and meat. It's just fascinating. Really fascinating. And again, the puzzles are actually good. They're not exactly grounded in reality in any way, but then again, the game isn't either, really. So it doesn't have to be. And that's perfectly fine. Yeah. Alright, so I hope you've enjoyed so far, and I will be back soon.